Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 uh, notification video. In this video, we'll take a look at the Atomic Shop, see what we got, and also we're going to take a look at the daily score challenges, see what we got to do in order to make some score. Plus, the double score event is still up, so I highly recommend you doing those challenges. But anyway, so let's stop wasting time here and jump right into the video. Alright, so let's uh, take a look what we got at the Atomic Shop today, and we'll need to go here, uh, scroll all the way down to the last section, and today we got with a 60% discount, Voltec uh, Canopies. Damn it. <laughs> I, I hope I pronounced that correctly. <laughs> okay, so here we go. This is what we got. By the way, if you get it, you get both options. So these two. 240. Well, I don't think I'll be using that, so I'm not going to get it. Um, right now, with the, the removal of the daily uh, challenges that gave us atoms and stuff like that, I'm going to be very picky. Very, very, very picky in terms of what I'm buying from the Atomic Shop. Because we cannot earn as many atoms as we could before. And uh, still, yeah. Let's go to the challenges. So for the challenges, we've got the following options. Before I read them through, I'd like to point out a little thing about join a group with another player uh, thing. I didn't know it works the other way. So when I joined the public server, uh, there were no free teams, so I created my own team. But when a person joined my team, I also got the challenge completed. So I didn't know that fact. Maybe that is something new for you as well. So uh, that's the way it is. So, let's take a look what we got. Buy an item or sell an item from another player. Pretty straightforward. You go to any camp with the vending machine, you buy uh, anything three times. So you gotta do three times transactions. Or just do uh, one bullet, one bullet, one bullet. <laughs> and done. So, claim a workshop. That's uh, pretty straightforward as well. If you're new to this game, workshops are these things over here. You can see sort of a uh, hammer and whatever the other thing is called I forgot what's in the, how it's called in English so please comment down below let me know how that other thing is called in English I am from Ukraine so sometimes I don't know a lot of stuff but anyway this is what you gotta capture there's a whole bunch of them if you see a player icon already over there like you see this angel guy that means it's already being claimed by someone if you're gonna be triggering it you're gonna trigger PvP with that person as well so for if if you're new to this game, I would highly recommend go with the Sunshine Meadows Industrial Farm since it's uh, the closest one to uh, the Flatwoods location. Plus it gives food, or you can go to the jo uh, George Junkyard, which George Junkyard, whichever comes. So that is also pretty much straightforward. Uh, afterwards, complete two events. You can collab it uh, whenever you capture one uh, in. A, a couple of minutes it will trigger a defensive uh, like this one right here so you can see defend Tyler country dirt track and you gotta do two of those so you can either do this one or anything else or just capture two workshops wait for them to trigger the uh, defense and do them uh, then we've got okay uh, gold star straightforward complete any five daily challenges and this will trigger automatically kill legendaries three of them so we got to find three legendaries and kill them uh, level up and well basically all you got to do is just level up one time in nuclear winter use three stim packs actually this one I'm not even gonna do uh, plant crop in uh, workshop or camp that's cool as well I'm gonna do that uh, I'm gonna collab this one with my workshop activity uh, since uh, I do have food and I can't be bothered retaking those and uh, kind of like uh, well, I'm just going to pick them up and replant them at the workshop, to put it plain and simple. But anyway, let me show you how you can complete these challenges right now as well. If you already know how to complete them and you see them, this, because they are it's pretty straightforward, I say to you, thank you for watching, and don't forget to hit that like. And now, let's go start with uh, capturing ourselves a workshop, and we're going to go with that one over there, one of my favorite and it's free and I got a fast travel bug again <laughs> so once you capture the workshop bam you get your challenges done then you open your building menu uh, navigate to your food section over here and as long as you have some components to craft food you just 
make it. And there you go, complete. If you don't have food in your camp, etc., then I would recommend you going uh, to this location right here. There's a whole bunch of corn and other stuff that you can pick up and just replant. So you can actually take that workshop and just plant, replant it over there. So it's going to be even easier for you to do. So uh, what else do I have? Let's go buy something from the player, which is also super simple. I usually go with the ammo, as it's simple. So, as I said, another player's vending machine, and you buy something three times. It doesn't matter whatever what you buy. All you gotta do is complete three transactions. Once you've done, you get the score. Bam. Oh, and I ranked up. <laughs> Woohoo! Sweet. Let's see what else we can do. Um, pfft. Uh, complete, complete two events. As I said, that's pretty straight to the point. Uh, use nu uh, in nuclear winter. Use three stim packs, as you you can see over here. I have actually hi highlighted those. Uh, if you really don't like playing nuclear winter, because uh, in order to use stim pack, you need to get damage. What I recommend: find the stim packs, find a ghoul or something. Let it hit you and you just use the stim packs you can leave. So I'm actually going to do that one. I pass out on the overseer. I'm not going to do that one. So then level up, kill three legendaries. So yeah, everything else is pretty much straight to the point. Alright Z-Clan and everybody else, you all know the drill. If you found this video useful, don't forget to hit that like, comment down below. Please make sure not to use profanity as those comments will be triggered by YouTube. Nobody will see them, I see them, I read them and I delete them. But uh, if you want a reaction to your comments, uh, just don't swear. You can always provide your negative feedback without swearing uh, in the comments, right? Uh, if you're new and you subscribe, welcome to Z-Clan. I'm Gamer Z Sol from Ukraine, so hi from Ukraine. I hope you enjoyed this video. And uh, if you want to join a cool community and play different games, not just Fallout 76, feel free to join our Discord. Uh, the link is down in the video description and uh, read the rules because if you get banned it's going to be a perma ban I'm not unbanning I'm anybody uh, in short family friendly don't get it read the rules <laughs> and uh, just follow the instructions if you need help there's a, I need help chat and we'll be able to help you out in order to get access to all the chats that you need in case if you get lost so Z Clan and everybody else thanks all for watching you all have a good morning day and night whatever you guys lock it at and I'll see you on the next video by the way if you want to stop by my when you my live streams today I'll be streaming Odysseus uh, the link to the twitch channel is down below in the video description and I'll see you later bye from the ashes we rose into the future we'll go we are Z Clan we have a game of the